Hello class, and welcome to this Bloxos EDU tutorial video about animating your characters. In this video, I'll walk through the steps to help you animate the different stages of character animations. To get started, we're going to go to Builder and jump into the Character Builder. Select the character that you want to animate, hit the open button, and it'll pull them up. The first thing we're going to work on is the idle animation, or what your character is doing while they're standing still. Now here at the bottom, we can select and add frames for this animation. So tap the plus sign to the right to add a frame. And you'll notice that it copies your art from one frame to the next. What we're going to do here is we're going to make Milo's shoulders go up and down and make his head go up and down. Just to kind of give him a little bit of a bob while he's standing around. Remember, when you're animating your characters, be as creative as you want. Maybe they tap their foot when they stand still, or maybe they blink. What you're seeing me do in this video is what I want to do with my character, but that doesn't mean you have to do it with yours. Watch along as I change small parts of my original character to make it look like he's moving while he's standing still. Now that I've moved his arms up, I'm going to add another frame, and in this frame, I'm going to move his head down. Now that I've moved his head down, I'm going to add another frame of animation. As you can see, it's starting to come together in the little idle box, and if you hit the play button, you can see him kind of bobbing right now. I'm going to add one more animation and have his arms go back down to the regular position. This will make it look a little more fluid when he bobs. You can always tap through the frames to see how the animation is coming along or hit the play button to see it in action. When you're done with your idle animation, you can check out your walk and jump animations. His walk animation has four frames and his jump animation is just one. You can also increase the rate of the animation so that you can make him move quickly or more slowly. When you're done with all your animations, tap on the green play button on the right and test them all out. So we can see him walk around, we can see him jump, and we can see his little idle animation. When you're done animating your character, make sure you go back to the character builder, select that character, and share your character to the class library, allowing your classmates to use what you've created, and for you to use what your classmates have created. That's going to do it for this tutorial. Thanks so much for watching. Have fun out there, and I'll catch you next time.